Ruthless, dominating, brutal, unforgiving and fanatical. There are only a couple of words that uh, describes uh, the Stormcast Eternals. I'm Miku, welcome back. I will paint today the Stormcast Eternals from the last expansion from uh, Underworlds and their legendary gold armor, but according to the accusation that I already placed, I wanted to paint the armor uh, in cold tones. Uh, I hope you will enjoy it and let's start! <clears throat> okay. Dark sea blue and heavy gold brown I mix together to receive uh, an olive color. And for this step I will paint only the uh, armor parts. After you applied heavy gold brown to your previous mix, set your airbrush to a little tiny spot and apply highlights. So this is the in-between step, mm. we have here a nice gold cold armor and for the next step mm, I have mixed Skarsnik green and some uh, white ink to receive this greenish cold color and we'll apply it to um, the airbrush. I uh, set up my airbrush to a very tiny dot. I can remove his weapon for now, uh, it is in my way. And you need to be very careful So uh, after the uh, little dot for the light reflection, that's, this is the result. I hope you could achieve uh, it at this point as I did. And uh, let's uh, go over to the next step. For edge highlight uh, of the armor, I mixed uh, heavy gold brown and uh, yellow green.
So, uh, in case of the base uh, for a Stormcast Eternal, I will start with Dark Earth. I will uh, highlight the base and the floating stone as a basic sketch. I mixed uh, Dark Earth and Greasy for the next highlight. <clears throat> I will let, uh, let this dry and will continue highlighting with the next color. Um, for the next highlight, uh, I will use Grazy. <clears throat> for Edge Highlight, I will use Packard Flash. Step, uh, I have diluted uh, electric blue from Vallejo. I will set up my airbrush to a very small dot. And will accent the areas uh, where the magic happens. So basically, between the, the stones, because our mage is trying to, to pull them up. So uh, leave 
this to dry and uh, we will take on with the next step in a couple of minutes. For the lightening effect uh, I will use some oil wash <coughs> and will drop only in the recesses and will wait till the paint flows. easily by itself. Okay, um, this needs um, a couple of minutes to dry before we take on with the next highlight, so leave it like it is and uh, I will show you the next step in a couple of seconds. <coughs> I have diluted uh, Caribbean turquoise from Vallejo. And uh, with a very small dot and very short triggers, I will overpaint the areas where we put it the <coughs> white color. Very subtle. It should be more a filter than a layer. white should shine through a little bit And this is it. I hope uh, you have enjoyed uh, my short tutorial for painting the good guys. Um, I hope you will be able to recreate it. Uh, you can comment down below, uh, hit the subscribe button and uh, like the tutorial if you liked the uh, recording. Um, have a nice week and I will see you next time. Bye bye. Thank you.